Okay, I don't know about this Russell Stover. I know about this one. And good. these are usually pretty good. Thumbs up. So these are... Okay. Those are good. I don't know about the rest of them. I'll have you engineer this onto YouTube with the thing ten. Oh yeah. <coughs> I don't know how to do all that stuff. I don't have video editing stuff. Otherwise, I'd do it. Um. To be honest. Oh, Lancaster is Lancaster a. Lancaster just came out. I've had their caramels, and I actually prefer Werther's over them. <coughs> don't ask me why. I've had both, and I yeah, I'd much rather have a Werther's than theirs. Um, these, okay, these, Brookside, these are <clears throat> a chocolate with a soft center in the middle that's flavored, and they are, like, <clears throat> to die for. Me and my coworkers used to go through a bag of these in two hours, this size bag in two hours. You're blocking your face. Good. <laughs> blocking your own face. Um, let's see. Dove, Raisinets, Reese's. Oh. Just come down this way. I'm a comment just aiming downwards. I, she had the Swedish fish. Yeah, she had the Swedish fish. Um, these are called trolleys. They're basically Grab sour. Really? I'm short. You want me to grab all this stuff? Please. Sour gummy worms. Very interesting. If you like gummy stuff. <clears throat> um, Swedish fish. I can't get the sour. Oh, yeah. The dudes. sour patch. Sour patch dudes. You have to stare at this one for a second. Well, here, just get the bottom ones. I mean, you have this bottom ones right here. That's fine. Yeah, because you have like three types of sour patch right here. Yeah, I know. Green, dudes, purple, and red. Those are the dudes I thought of there. No. That, they're, they're right there. They're right there behind that one. Look over there. There you go. Hey, you can go ahead and go through. Okay, go ahead. So I guess now Sour Patch is coming out with different things because now they're making them shapes of strawberries, different fruits. And then this is the normal Sour Patch Kids, but these are supposedly two times bigger. I don't know. So they're Mucha they're, Grande Kids. They're usually about like that big. I guess they're now maybe this big. If I had to guess without opening it, I don't know. But yeah, those are Sour Patch Kids. <coughs> um, <coughs> Twizzler Bites. Sweet Tarts. Uh, Starburst. Everybody pretty much knows. These are... These aren't the size I wanted to show you. But... Straight, Twizzlers... Straight in the bag. Well, what? Because you're the one on what? camera, not me. Yeah, you should be, not me. Mm. You're the one that speaks better than me and looks better than me. Whatever. Uh, Twizzlers and these guys, actually, these are not the straws I want to show you. There's longer ones. But if you stick these in soda, they're actually pretty good and work really good as straws. So, but you gotta, I have to find you guys the big ones, not the small ones. Um, new small paydays. Oh. This is what I want to show. Whooper is my favorite. Malted Whoppers. milk. Do you guys have like Mikeanites and Runts and Gobstoppers? And runts, no. Gobstoppers, no. Mikeanites, yes. Okay. Nerd, she tried. Now and Laters? You could get that one, Now and Laters. Bottle caps. Krabby Patties. SpongeBob SquarePants. Right here. And Red Hots. And Red Hots, do you have both? No, I don't think so. Or Hot Tamales, whatever. Hot Tamales or Red Hots? Either, I don't I don't think we have either. Okay, alright, fine. I'll start out with these. These are runts. They're fruit-shaped candies. Oh, fuck. These are called gobstoppers, and we're going to have to stop the video in a minute. Basically, like um, they're a hard candy. You like it, like a jawbreaker. No, because a jawbreaker doesn't change colors nor flavors. This actually will, and does dissolve, and you can't eat. The so milk. it changes colors and flavors. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. These are now and later's. They're basically a long-lasting chewy candy. If you ever have uh, 
I'm saying we gotta let some people buy. Hold on a second. Go ahead. Back to you. You can go ahead, go by. It's no problem. It's just a video for people from Israel that are live in Japan, so it's all good. We're just showing them all the candies we have. Uh, what the heck am I thinking of? You guys, well, no. Yeah, okay. Perfect example that we still have standing here somewhere. Friggin', oh, there it is, Starburst. Starburst! They're basically the same thing as Starburst, only last like 10 minutes longer. As I like drop candy all the time. Oh, that's right. These are the bottle caps. They're soda flavored candy. Always fun. And do I really want to go there about Krabby Patty? I, I don't does know. Does she know SpongeBob? Yeah, she. Really? SpongeBob is huge in Japan. I don't know. And China. Like, like, like they have even their own version of, of, of all that Konnichiwa and saying Doesn't hello. Doesn't mean in she watches it. I don't know. She maybe. Okay. Well, basically, if you We're arguing on camera right now. Sponge, we can... I don't care. <laughs> you ever seen SpongeBob? They came out with cherry, grape, blueberries, and green apple flavored Krabby Patty candies. SpongeBob is a big craze, and we get all kinds of candies inspired by him. Now, no, oh, okay. This one. This one. <coughs> okay. Despite these being all hot and cinnamony and stuff, they actually are different. Um, Sorry. Red Hots is a round, hard candy. You can't chew them. I mean, you can chew them, but it'll hurt your teeth. Um, you're better off sucking on them and then chewing them. But yeah, these are all the craze. If you like cinnamon. Meaning for me. If, uh... See, that's a burn I can take, cinnamon. Okay, then you should be able to eat hot fries without a problem. Oh, I never showed her hot fries. So that's Dude. another section. I'll show you some hot fries. Good. Uh, these are we'll hot just send her some tamales. hot fries. Yeah. Uh, these are hot tamales. They're cinnamon flavored. The only difference is you guys have Mike and Ike's, right? Yeah, we should have Mike and Ike's. You yeah. have Mike and Ike's? I, I'm, not, I'm not 100% sure, but last time we were there, yeah. Okay. I saw they're them pretty much the same consistency as Mike and Ike's, only hot cinnamon flavored. And then these are... Dark chocolate covered Red Hots. So basically the same thing as the Red Hots before, only with chocolate over them. Never had these before. Yeah, that was actually they... pretty interesting. It's sweet and, uh, and spicy. Sweet and spicy. Hmm. Interesting. Um, Back to the trollers. Okay, like we said. Try to stay anything, away from anything with that logo on it. Great value right there. That means it's the Walmart knockoff brand, meaning it... It's inspired by the candy, but doesn't have as potent ingredients or even as good of an ingredient as normal candies. Do you have Laffy Taffy? Laffy Taffy? We should. I don't know. I'm not sure. We should show it to her. I mean, she's going to text us back and tell us what she wants. What she would like to try. Yeah, you're right. Please do that. Can you take a picture? Uh, video, but you can go ahead and pass. It's no, no big deal. People here are extremely polite, like you know. It's not like everybody thinks that we're, um, all, all of us Americans are rude. Laffy Taffy. I've, See, she had Airheads before, so it's basically a version of Airheads, right? No. No? Ta this is Taffy. Taffy is different consistency of Airheads. Um, trying to find a bag of Airheads. Well, this has got Airheads in it, but I don't see one. Anyway, Airheads is the chewy candy. This is even worse. We're, I'm looking for the Warheads to show them. Candy. I don't see no Warheads. Yeah, I don't see no Warheads either. Um, we have a normal Jelly Belly. Jelly 40 food. flavors. Different flavors that I mean. Tootsie Rolls. Oh. Does she have caramel apple pops? I don't know. Well, well, I guess. Caramel, let us know. Caramel apple pops. And here's a, here's like, I think this is another type of jelly beans. I don't know, a new company that came out? Just like Jelly Belly? Gourmet jelly beans. I don't know. I mean, granted, yeah, they don't have the crazy flavors like Jelly Belly, like the... No, uh, they do. They got tiramisu, pomegranate. I'm talking about the snot and vomit ones. Perfectly pear. No. No, no snot and vomit, but... Yeah, they're, 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 
They're they're satisfaction guaranteed. That's what it says on the back. Oh. Um, yeah, I am not seeing any What's that? <laughs> okay, something made her laugh, and I'm guessing it's I. It's a, it's a, oh my gosh! I don't know why people think of this moment. Okay, so you know licorice, right? Yeah. You know black licorice, yeah. correct? How about a Scottish dog shaped black licorice? Literally shaped as a Scottish dog. You can eat it, and it tastes like black licorice. Okay. Who wants to eat a, a Scottish dog? Not me. I don't know. If you want to, yeah. Go right ahead. Lifesavers. It is Twizzlers. Twizzlers. Oh. Um. <coughs> Ooh, okay. <coughs> you know what? Perfect. These, not the filled ones. Not the filled Twizzlers. Um, the Hershey ones will work, but I've never had them before. As far as this. But if you ever drink... Um, their focus, like, they, their focus is more on water and tea. I heard. I don't know. I don't. I. I, I know their focus is. Is it really? On like water and tea and stuff. Well, I mean, I water. mean, Ira said, Ira said in the, in her videos that she doesn't drink that much pop. So. You know what? It might actually still work in water though. It might give the water some flavor. Yeah. Basically, okay. There you go. To, um, if you have now, it only works with a twist. It won't really work with regular Twizzlers because of the fact that the hole's not big enough. But if you take these and bite the ends off on each end and stick it in any drink, I don't think it'll really be all that great in tea. But stick it in water and it might actually change the flavor to whatever the flavor is for the Twizzler. I know with soda it doesn't. I haven't tried it with water. Probably might actually do the same thing. But it has to be the Twist. And it obviously can't be the filled one. So that won't work either. Um, you guys have Smarties. I'm not worried about that one. Bubblegum. See, they're all bubblegum. I don't know. Do you, does, do you think Ron and Ira would like snack packs? Snack packs! Right here. Yeah, those are snack packs. What is that? Oh, these are sausage sticks. I'm, I don't know what the heck they were. I'm trying to figure it out. This is a big thing. In America, I don't know if I'd ever want to ship it. What? I'm trying to find one. Okay, here's one. This is a huge thing of America. Okay. American love sausage. They love their beef. They love their beef jerky, which is not in this section. It's actually completely the other section. So why this stuff is even here, I have no idea. Some Walmart mess up, probably. Because they're pretty picky about where stuff goes and marketing and all that stuff. But, um... Us Americans, we like sausage sticks and beef sticks and all that stuff. So they've started to package them like this, where you get sausage sticks, pretzels, and cheese all in one and guaranteed for months. How cheese is outside a fridge and guaranteed for months, I really don't want to know. Hence the reason why I don't eat these things. But a lot of people do. So I don't know if you want to experiment and try one of these things. Let us know. Let us know. Because they also have just straight sausage sticks with uh, Frozen, apparently, for the kids. Or Avengers or Ninja Turtles. Or Turtles or Avengers or, yeah. Kids. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, that's something new. Yeah, it is. That's those pudding new... Pouches. Pudding pouches. And apparently, this is breakfast in a pouch. And what's the other Again. one? Uh, pudding. <coughs> breakfast. <coughs> breakfast. Banana maple breakfast. Why this stuff is here and not in the other one, I don't know. This is more pudding. I don't know pudding. And we're done.